Hey there, Beat Buddians. Um, here's a quick little video on showing you how I send MIDI out of my door into the Beat Buddy. So for creating beats, creating songs, it is much, much quicker and more efficient to do it in the door. For me, I have found. I found the BB, beat, uh, BBM, Beat Buddy Manager, is quite clunky to try and make adjustments. Um, so what's happening is I've got a Roland UM1 cable, which is USB here coming out, which is this little doovy whacker there, which goes to the MIDI in of my Beat Buddy, which down there. So there's my Beat Buddy. So that's my live board. So that's what, that's it. That's how I use it uh, when I'm at gigs. So at the moment, it just sits there, I don't touch it. It's just got, I've got my brushes kit set up because that's the kit that I use the most. I can hear these beats really quickly by just changing the kits on the Beat Buddy if I wanted to. Um, but for now, I'm just using, the, I'm happy with the brushes kit, which I've added um, tambourines and shakers and stuff into. And that's where I think the this method really shines when you're using shakers and tambourines, um, especially shaker. It can be really bit fiddly to get them to sound nice and realistic so for example say like so here's my door i'm just using ableton i find ableton good for this type of thing um so here's a midi clip so this is my main beat for this song so if i open that up so there's my shake there's my shaker so if i want to change the uh, like the whole the row so i've got all my individual velocities happening which i'm happy with but i can go through and then audition them if i want to make them louder or softer and hear them in real time how they how they're going to sound and i've got it set up with my live speaker so i know exactly how it's going to sound um and my tambourine for example so on my tambourine i have about six or seven different tambourine sounds within the tambourine instrument on different velocities so i can So like on 127, for example, I've got a shake only on that velocity. So I know at the end of a song I can use that and it um, sounds good. Um, so once, yeah, I get all my beats sounding how I want them and then I just export the MIDI clip and then import it into BBM and boom, away you go. Um, so I hope that makes sense. I don't think, um, I hope I explained it okay. And I hope, it, yeah, I hope you can see it. Um, oh man, it's sped up my like writing parts and fine tuning parts by like 7 billion trillion percent. Like imagine, as you'd probably, if you use a BBM, you'd know you're going to the BBM. If you want to adjust like your shakers, you've got to go into each one and it's fiddly and it's blah, blah, blah. This just makes it super snappy and fast and, uh, totally awesome so yeah there you go i hope it helps hey i'm trent crawford i'm trent crawford on the uh beat buddy forum and um it's such a great um uh place for information i've got so much great stuff off of that forum so i hope that this gives something back to somebody um yeah happy beat buddying and i'll uh see you on the forum adios